When war tore through Yugoslavia, a group of diplomats, historians and businessmen vowed they would do everything to ensure such a tragedy would not happen again. We are the Center for Democracy and Reconciliation in Southeast Europe and since 1998 we have been working on bringing to life democracy and reconciliation in Southeast Europe through our education, media and social inclusion projects. We protect civil society. We prevent conflict. We guard social principles. Through the past two decades, we have touched the lives of millions through our projects. We teach biased historical events. We lack open discussion and dialogue. We class over culture and religion. Our flagship project is the Joint History Project, which are common history texts translated into 11 languages and used in schools in Western Balkan countries. The six books cover the period from the Ottoman Empire to 2008 and teach students to think critically. We have trained 2,000 teachers and have reached half a million students. They are used in 13 countries and are supported by six ministries of education. I am pleased to say that um, the European Commission could uh, support this project, which I think is an extremely valuable one, and I think it's one of the best invested uh, money. Dobrodošli u okruženje. Okruženje, or Vicinities in English, is the first and only regional TV news talk show in the Western Balkans, broadcast on 10 TV channels simultaneously. After five successful seasons, the European Citizenship Award was bestowed to Okruženje, Vicinities in English. It brings together experts, guests from different countries to discuss political and social topics that affect daily life. It is now in its sixth season with 60 filmed episodes. The show has gathered 250 guests in total. It has been viewed by millions. We also have experience in reintegrating internally displaced persons and refugees. Our Refugees Project Acceptance helps them integrate and be accepted by the local people and vice versa. Through our project Employment Empowered, we provided 30,000 services to thousands of families across the Balkans. We need to hear refugee stories and discuss European values. This way, we hope to fight division and potential extremism. In 2013, the Friedrich Herbert Stiftung Human Rights Award was bestowed to the CDRSE. Our work is not done yet. Our projects, crucial back in the 90s, have now become urgent today. We sow the seeds of optimism to grow tomorrow's diverse society.